Well, hello and welcome to Arena Clash of Champions. My name is Ripper X. Welcome to the party. This is my first impressions. We're going to be jumping into the game for 15 to 20 minutes today and checking it out for the first time. Now, Arena Clash of Champions is developed by Cliffhanger Productions. One of the cool things about the game is that it's not only available on Steam, but it's available on your tablet as well. You can take this wherever you go. Now, another big thing for me is the league system. There's highly competitive gameplay modes in this game. Once you get past the tutorial stages, you will start off in the Bronze League. If you're a good player and you work your way up the ladder, you can eventually get to the more competitive leagues. Yes, matches against real players from computers across the world. No, seriously, very excited about the competitive gameplay of Arena. Let's jump in and take a look at the game. Here we go. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, today, live, another exciting battle for Aether. And here are the fearless combatants. No mere human can prevail against the perfection of my machines. Looks like uh, Valerian's gonna have a bad day today. Let's see what happens. Bloody, I would be scared of of someone named Bloody Mary. I don't know. Just uh, just me. Just my opinion. So again, this looks like another tutorial uh, run here. Looks like uh, you know, we didn't start from the beginning. They kind of started halfway through the match, which is fine. Two enemy uh, champions are on the battlefield already. It looks like uh, with Bloody Mary's rifle, she can sh shoot champions from far away, but only in a straight line. Okay. The area I can attack in has a red outline. Okay. Oh, I see that. All right. That's pretty cool. So it's almost like a T right here. So she can't do any damage just yet, but I, I guess I can move her this way. Nice. All right, let's try it. Oh! Okay, Crank says, see that floating guy over there? They call him the bug. His lightning attacks don't even need a direct line of sight. Makes him quite dangerous. That's kind of scary, actually. Okay, the turn order panel shows you who's up next. If you tap or click on a portrait, you can see what the champion is capable of. Okay. Okay, so each champion obviously is going to have different skill sets. Each champion is going to do different damage, they have different health. Very interesting. This could be very strategic. I guess that's, that's what this game's all about, being strategic in the first place. I'm excited to actually uh, go into PvP and, uh, and maybe uh, have a match against a real player. Probably going to get my butt kicked though, but I guess uh, we'll continue on with the tutorial here though at least. Okay, Crank says, I could punch a hole in this toaster in, me in melee. Crank says, I can punch a hole in this toaster in melee. Move me to the next tin head and let's wreck him. All right. This guy's a, he's pretty beast. Okay, here we go. <laughs> nice, two damage. Okay, he's dead. Impossible, you've bested my automation, but... Okay, it looks like Valerian just summoned uh, another champion here. Oh, he also summoned a Bloody Mary, okay. Nice, so something I just realized, I guess, we, we not only can attack the champions, but uh, we can attack the ship. And it, since, since we have a free shot on the ship, and the ship only has one health, I think we just won, won the match, right? Let's try it. <laughs> nice, that's awesome. <laughs> yeah, over. What a victory. Sensational. Okay, again, still in tutorial mode. Craig says, let's do this. Get me close to Lily's video champion over there so I can punch him in the balls. Cool, all right. Uh, Lily's voodoo champion, I guess, is right here. The Corporal, Dan Hut. Okay. 
Okay, so we actually uh, are kind of starting fresh here. It's, it's already, uh, looks like three on one. It's time to spawn a champion. I guess let's take a look and see the champions that we have on the on the bottom here. I'm going to hold down my left mouse button. Ooh, the Butcher. I like this. Health 6, damage 2, movement 3, attack pattern 1. Let's see what he has here. Uh, one of his special abilities, Hook Pull. Pulls the target towards the Butcher and deals 2 damage. Okay, that's pretty epic. Uh, the second one is called Belly Bomb. Pulls himself towards his target and explodes, knocking back all the adjacent champions and dealing 2 damage. Uh, that's going to happen about right now. I'm definitely going to go with the Butcher here. I'm not even going to look at the other champions. Lady Aurora. Oops. Okay, I messed up. I thought I spawned the butcher. I guess I didn't do that. Oops. That's okay. Uh, I'll take Aurora here. Looks like that's a pretty nice... Uh... Ouch. Okay, I just got punched. Okay, that Aurora chick also brought some ether, sh ether shells with her, but we need to fill up your ship's ether first. Okay, Ether has something to do with, um, with, with like, our power or something like that. Um, again, these guys are all on zero Ether, which is a good thing, I think. I have two Ether with, uh, six over here. I don't know exactly what I need to do, but I guess we'll just continue to do this. Nice. I, I, I like it. It's not just about finding the champions. It, it, the, whole, the whole goal is to actually shoot the other person ship so it's cool it, it really does bring some strategy to the game the whole goal is not to, I mean obviously you want to kill those the enemy champions but you know it's uh it's, it's cool there's a ship you can uh, destroy as well there's you know multiple things you can do here I guess so whenever your opponent's vessel loses health you gain one ether for your own ship whether from a direct attack or vanquish champion all right okay so I have seven ether Okay, this is coming from our ship. This is our ship's weapons or something like that. Scorchy deals three damage to an enemy champion. Okay. Well, three damage would be nice to this guy so we can get him off the board. Let's do it. I love these cutscenes. It's scorching. Ooh. Hot. Okay, someone got sunburned. Lily, I didn't expect that, but two can play at this game, amigo. Wave Bloody Mary goodbye. Uh-oh. Making some personal space with Shockwave. Okay, losing Bloody Mary damaged our own ship, but ship damage also means more ship ether. For every point of damage we receive, we gain one ether. So we're back to seven again. We are one ether short for the ether discharge shell. Move me to that ether infuser tile. So there's a tile in the middle here. Uh, looks like maybe we get extra ether if we move to us. Let's try it. Nice. All right, let's try this. A massive ether discharge is wrecking this ship. What a victory! Sensational! Due to the upcoming Steam release, the current league will end on May 4th and a new season will start. Dawn Season. Now, Dawn Season will end on July 1st with awesome rewards, real money prizes for the top Ether Masters, what? Chance to win one of two iPads in Diamond and Master Tiers. The new dates will be set in the next patch. We will patch within the week and introduce a new champion, a new arena, and new spells. This message is brought to you by the United Nations Competitive League Enforcement, UNCLE. 
pretty cool. I did not know they had this. They're really going all out here. Arena, uh, the game, Clash of Champions, bringing some league and competitive gameplay to the masses. This is awesome. I knew it was competitive, but I didn't realize this is going to be on another level here. They're offering real money and prizes. That's pretty cool. Anytime that happens, you're going to get people that really are going to uh, pick apart this game and learn how to play. Probably going to get my butt kicked really bad now. I thought I was actually going to do okay. I'm starting to have second thoughts on this. Let's go to the port. This is the place I can hire champions, buy ships, and uh, buy shell packs. Let's check it out. Ship shop. I'm only level two. I have a long ways to go here. Oh my goodness. Except we have... Okay, Ark. Wow, that's pretty sweet. My, wow. It's, it's on sale, but uh, again, I'm not level 27. That's not going to happen. Uh, Sparrow, level, level 21. And then we have here level 15. Okay, it wants me to click on this here. What's this? Oh, okay, this is the shell shop. See those shell packages? You're not ready for all of them yet, but you soon will be. Anyway, select this. Sh okay. Let's do it. The attack pack. Here we go. You don't have enough shillings yet, but here are the ether coins I have saved up by the pack with those. Oh, I get it. So there's two ways to buy uh, packs, it looks like, with uh, ether or uh, with money. Okay. Okay, let's just take a moment and enjoy this picture immensely. Wow. Pretty cool picture. Look at that bird. He's having a great day. This is like one of the best days he's ever had or something like that. Polly wants a, cra a cracker. Polly wants a cracker or something like that. Have fun with your new shells. Boom, boom, boom. Okay. So left click here. You get a new shell. Sweet. Okay. Wow. Another shell. Wow. Three different sh uh, shells. Inter interesting. Okay. Arena Clash of Champions is easy to learn, hard to master. I could be wrong, but it, it seems like there's a lot of really cool technical strategy minded uh, stuff you can you can do in terms of your champions and in, in terms of your shells and in terms of your ship as well so uh, again i'm ranked 603rd league points 20 okay let's search for a match this is really happening guys let's check it out sky bucket is a ship i can't again i don't have enough money to get uh, any new ships and i don't think i have enough money to get any new champions but i'm happy with the basic champions i have wait a second there's a there's another guy right here martel oh bug I don't think I can get Bug yet. That, do I have 200? No, I don't have enough. Let me see if I can get uh, Martel here. Looks like I'm just short. Oh, that sucks. I'm literally, you know, maybe next uh, match. Even if I lose this match, I should have enough to get this guy next. Um, what does he do, though? Is there any, can I, let's hit info real quick. Wow, eight health, that's pretty decent. Uh, damage two, movement two. What's his special abilities here? In your face, deals three damage to an adjacent enemy target. Mortar sacrifices himself to do three damage to the enemy ship. That's awesome. Uh, basically, using Martel for the end game could be really uh, effective. Okay, 45 seconds. It looks like I don't have a lot of to choose from. I just have these two shells. Okay, so the party begins. Ripper X versus EF. Keep on rocking. Uh oh. Let's uh, let's start with Martel here. I'm gonna bring this guy in here. Martel, jumping. Lady Aurora. Ha <laughs> ha! Bloody Mary! It's a steel fist crank. It's steel fist crank. Ha <laughs> ha! Bloody Mary! Okay, I'm starting to get the hang of this a little bit more here. Oh, she's going to shoot my ship? Crap.
go ahead and attack the ship as well here. Ouch. Definitely take her down. Take her down to Chinatown. Massive ether discharge is wrecking this ship. Martell stumping. Lady Aurora. It's nice, I, I have the freedom over here. She's all by herself. Uh, Bloody Mary's just shooting the ship here. If I, if I can keep her safe... Uh-oh. <laughs> I, I guess that wasn't going to last. Uh, good to know. Knock her back a bit. Oh, looks like they both get knocked back. That's awesome. I didn't realize that. That's really good to know. This is gonna hurt though. Oh, maybe not. Only one damage. Two damage. Three damage to all enemy Light champions. Like it was Christmas. That's epic. So we got one champion down, and she's down to three as well. Huge, 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 huge. Gonna go ahead and get some more ether here. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Down to seven health. I think I can actually pull something off here. We'll see what happens. I guess the question, should I kill this guy? Yeah, I probably should, huh? I mean, I could go this way, take one turn, and then attack the ship. No, let's attack this guy. Wow, almost ran out of time. Wow, that was so close. Got really lucky there. Oh, I just missed my turn. Unbelievable. I totally just missed my turn there. That sucked. I'm going to go for it. I'm going to go straight for the ship here. Ha <laughs> ha! Bloody Mary! Looks like I have him blocked. This is actually looking pretty good, guys. Although he's ramping up ether here. This could be dangerous. All right, one more shot. That's going to take uh, one of his champions down as well as a uh, point to his ship, right? Ship down to six. Oh, down to five. Nice. Although eight ether is dangerous. He can play it's something steel here. Fist crank. 
Oh, this is going to be huge. Watch this move. Oh, I didn't knock her off? Oh, I thought I, I, I thought I knocked her off. That's crazy. Let's try this one more time. Wow, what a match! This is crazy! Ship is down to one health, guys. I think this could be the game here. Ha <laughs> ha! Bloody Mary! Go ahead and kill a champion. That's the game! Yes! That is the game! What a victory! Sensation! That was a, that was a heck of a match. I, uh, wow, I am just astonished. Heck of a match. Nice. Good game to uh, to keep on rocking. Well played, my friend. I did not... I really am surprised I actually won that. That was crazy. It really is... Uh, it's it's all about a combination of strategy and positioning and, and your champions and... Wow, there's a lot of stuff to this. Again, as you level up, you're going to be unlocking different things here. Okay, 60 shilling and one scorching shell. Sweet. All right, next uh, uh, level unlock support, you will obtain one healing. Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Well, guys, thanks so much for tuning in. This is my first impressions of Arena Clash of Champions. Pretty cool game. This is uh, $10 on Steam. It's, it's a $10 game. You can get this for literally uh, 10 bucks on Steam. This is going to be a competitive game once it comes out and hits release. I believe, uh, obviously, the game still is in beta, but once there is a release to the game, I think it's going to be really fun to see how people play. And uh, so far, I've been having fun. I'm definitely going to be jumping back in and playing more. A lot of fun so far in Arena Clash of Champions. Look at I'm already down to 292. That's awesome. So I'm, I guess I'm 292 in the Bronze League. Again, I've won one match so far. That's pretty good for me, at least. A lot of fun playing, though. Thanks again for tuning in, guys. More information here at MMORPG.com. I'll post a link below this video in the description as well as I will post a link to the official site of Arena Clash of Champions. Thanks again for watching guys. My name is Rick. See you guys next week.